Hello everyone and welcome to Red United TV. It's your boy Ivor and Spice back at it again with another match reaction. And guys, if you're new to this channel, remember to subscribe, smash that like button, and also remember to share because sharing Ivor and Spice is caring. Woo, 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 woo. And those who are new to the channel, remember you can always contribute via the link description, via PayPal, and also check out the rest of the link description for other things. But first of all, let's get straight into it because it is Manchester shitty for Manchester United one. Manchester United getting thrashed in the Manchester derby, an absolute disgrace. A shit performance has hurt us all on a Sunday. We got piped in. We got packed in again at the empty head. Manchester City fans singing world fucking shit and we are shit. We've been shit. It's a disgrace. It says it all and this shows everything. This shows exactly how truly the previous regime has left us in a state. It was an embarrassing, shambolic performance against Manchester City. And they enjoyed it. Some of them had joy. It was impressive. The boys had no character. A lot of players let us down, but it was expected. You know, we knew it was going to be a tough game. We knew it was going to be a tough game. We were going to hold back. We were going to not have possession. By the way, but guys, at one point, Man City had 92% of the possession of the ball at one moment there. But it's been poor. And you can even talk about the game itself, the way it started. With De Kevin De Bruyne so damn early in the first couple of minutes. Four minutes in, Manchester United concede a goal by Kevin De Bruyne. Kevin De Bruyne enjoying himself. Man Manchester City doing a typical Man City goal. Fizzing the ball in for Kevin De Bruyne to pass it in. Tap it in. Easy, easy first goal by Manchester City. And Manchester City enjoying himself at times. Eventually, Jaden Sancho restored honour to Manchester United. Big ups to Jaden Sancho. Brilliant pass, brilliant counter attack, and brilliant play by Paul Pogba to find him for Sancho to dwell on the ball and, and wait and wait and then slot it into the corner. Brilliant finish by Jaden Sancho. Just lovely goal. It was a lovely goal at Manchester United. But then normality came when Man City made it two goals to one. Another easy goal. And this time, Maguire. I know Foden had joy, but Maguire, you can defend way better. The ball went underneath Maguire's um, legs. And then again, try to block it again. And everything there, you can just see is Maguire's fault. Kevin De Bruyne scoring from ricochets and ricochets. David De trying his best to do what he can to save Manchester United. Not going to see that much goal. But he couldn't do that. De, De Bruyne scoring, half-time 2-1. It looked like Manchester United, listen, we can take a 2-1 win. We can really take it. But no, it couldn't be. Man City really wanted to spoil the party. They really did at times. We looked dangerous at times on breaks. But then Mares made it 3-1 from a set-piece corner. That Kevin De Bruyne crossing the ball from a set-piece corner for, for Mares himself to just smash it in. Smash it in easy. And we struggle with set-pieces and we're just conceding goals. And now we hired a set-piece coach for this. And look at this. We are still conceding from set pieces and we're not scoring them. And Maguire himself, pussy, pum pum, soft, soft ass, could have scored a set piece but couldn't finish it because he couldn't think for himself. And then just when you think things can't get any worse, after City just destroying us, possession base, 92, again, 92% of the ball, guys. Horrible, horrible. Ah! Ruins everything. It's a disgrace. And Gary Neville was so damn right. The guys lost it. Their hopes dropped. Everything dropped against Manchester United. These boys are pom poms. They're not about this. Then when Morris made it 4 1, De Gea was doing whatever he can to stop us. VAR couldn't save Manchester United today. And it confirmed with the fourth goal. Tremendous. Tremendously. I am so disappointed. In so many ways. I expected the defeat, but not this defeat. Full time with Man City winning. Four goals to one. Disgrace. Players were all horrible. Sancho had a decent 45 minutes, but majority of the time he was out the game. Bruno, Hollywood pass, giving the ball away as always. The only good player in midfield that done well was Paul Pogba because he didn't lose the ball at times. And he was the only positive aspect as well for, for outlet in terms of midfield playmaking. The rest had a poor game. Aaron Psycho. How are you going to get moved by Phil Foden? 
A skinny prick. A toothpick. A toothpick. You're supposed to be spider one. You're supposed to be spider one. And a toothpick barges you off the pitch. Barges you off the ball as well. A disgrace. Oh, what has happened to Aaron wan -Bissaka? Man of the match today, guys. Gonna have to give it up to David De Gea for saving us at so many times. A lot of times. Donkey of the match goes down to Slabhead, Captain Maguire. I've had enough of this guy. He's not our captain. He cost us goals and goals and goals and goals. You truly suck, my friend. You truly suck. You have ruined our week. It's been a poor back-to-back -back Premier League games. A draw and a loss. It is what it is. Manchester United fans, let me know what you think of today's game. Let me know what your, who your man in the match was and your donkey of the match as well. Most importantly, remember to subscribe, smash that like button and press that notification bell up for whenever I upload or go live, you will know. And last but not least, for Manchester United Holics, next game, just have to take it. We've lost. We've got, we need to get over it. It's going to be hard going back into work and going back into school with our friends and peers laughing at us. We're going to have to hide our face. For those who work at home, you're lucky. But it is what it is, guys. This has been your match reaction by Ivory and Spice. As always, remember to keep it united and remember to keep it red united because your boy is out. Peace!